the upside of the carpet industry in Dalton over the years was plenty of jobs and a higher percentage of millionaires than your average small Georgia town. But there was a downside. The industry literally drained the city's water supply dry. However, new innovations are changing all that. Amy Catcher continues Our Town Dalton. The carpet industry can be a big user of natural resources. We always uh, used a lot of water, the second largest outside of Atlanta. But now, Dalton companies like J&J &J and Vision find new ways to use less. They can measure the amount of water and dye needed more accurately. They also now reuse some water in the dyeing process. First and foremost, uh, we think it's very important to be good stewards of our environment. It's good business practice not to be wasteful. Customers agree. They ask. They want to know how much water went into the production of their uh, product that they're buying. Using less means there's more for new business. If an industry needs water, we have plenty. Anderson says while they've never had to turn away any interested businesses, water availability may have kept Dalton from taking a closer look at some industries in the past. Now the struggling city can recruit new companies. We knew three years ago that at some point that was going to change, and that's when we began to put together an economic development team and process. As well as ways to advertise Dalton's desirable location and proximity to I-75, low taxes and well-trained workforce. When you've had 60 years of uh, unprecedented economic growth and very low unemployment, you're not real aggressive on economic development. Anderson says one of the biggest draws for a business is the quality of life here in Dalton for its workers. We can target the chemical industry, the plastics industry, advanced manufacturing. All of those would be naturals for us to recruit from. Now it's a matter of getting business offers that hold water. In Dalton, Amy Catcher, WDEF News 12. Now Anderson says another big draw to Dalton is the college. Dalton State caters to both community college and traditional four-year college students. Now the city isn't just relying on manufacturing, though, for its economic future, though. Tomorrow, we're going to look at how Dalton is trying to become a tourist destination. We'll show you why train fans, Civil War buffs, and cyclists are drawn to the area. And in case you miss our town Dalton reports, you can see them on our website. Just go to WDEF.com and click on the Our Town banner in the right column.